Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and very good morning to everyone. Um, so today in this video, we are going to present about uh, SL2, which is making financial decision for the subject MTH3701, financial mathematics. So here is the list for group members. Uh, my name is Muhammad Shahidini bin Muhammad Nafi with my feed number 201134. My name is Nurin Ali binti Nur Adlan. My matrix number is 200325. My name is Ahmad Zain Bihudi bin Amran. My matrix number is 202825. My name is Aina Anissa bin Asidin. My matrix number is 200678. My name is Nuridaya binti Abdul Jamil. My matrix number is 203560. Okay, uh, so next is the contents. Here we have seven sections which is job, car, home affordability, home down payment, payment and interest and the last one it would be other financial commitments. Next. So, uh, let's move to the next section which is job. So here, uh, we as a student, of course, we have a dream job, right? So, uh, as we discussed, we plan we will be graduating with PhD with mathematics related major. So uh, we decide to be the lecturer as um, our career. So as you can see here, uh, here is the further information about the dream job. So first is the level of the study, which is PhD with mathematics related major. And the age it would be at 28 years old. And the, the dream job it would be lecturer. And about the grade, it would be DM45, and the field, of course, it would be mathematics. And also, uh, we also expect that we are going to receive a monthly salary around 3,000 ringgit to 3,500 ringgit. So, um, since we already have a dream job, so of course, we have to find a job vacancy, right? So, um, we try to make some survey uh, to find job vacancy via a few sources. So we managed to find a job vacancy uh, to an advertisement that is provided by UITM Jawangan Negeri Sembilan. So here we can see the, the, the qualification here, the details. So the job will be lecturer and the level of the study, they require us to have PhD with mathematics related major. And the field, of course, it would be mathematics. Huh? So the grade here, it offers DM45. And um, it also provides the money survey, which is uh, 3380.37 ringgit manager. And the place for this job, it would be UITM Chuangan Negeri Sembilan at Campus Kuala Pilah Meeting, 72000 Kuala Pilah at Negeri Sembilan. So uh, here is the reference for the job vacancy, which we get it from this website, which is nagrisambilanuitm.edu.my. So uh, why do we choose the lecturer as our job? Actually, there are three main reasons we choose this job, actually. So for the first of all is it would be the level of the study itself. Since uh, based on the advert advertisement, it requires us to have a PhD, right? So we think that we achieve the criteria that they want. So for the field itself, of course, it requires us and uh, we have PhD with mathematics related majors. So we strongly believe that the job is uh, eligible for us. Uh, plus, actually, we choose this job because uh, we love to teach mathematics subject. So for the next part, it would be the salary. So uh, we actually expect to receive a money salary around 3,000 to 35,000 3, 5, 0, 0, right? So as stated on the advertisement, it, uh, it provides us the money salary, which is 3,380.37 3, ringgit Malaysia. So we think that this salary is relevant for this job. So um, I'm going to praise about car. So of course, um, if we, we if we already have some work, we possibility have some car because how can we manage to go to the work if we don't have car? Since um, our house is not so far, not so far 
since it's just only around 25 to 30 minutes but it is impossible to walk or if we take it a grab every day so it can of cost so uh the type of vehicle that we are going to choose is uh of course it must be comfortable cheap small and also safety so we are uh, we are planning to buy a asia 1.0 g so for description of this car is is asia is one of the cheapest cheapest car on sale and it's also a small car it is lower consumption and lower full bills and it also what enough for uh average size adult so the this is the description of car which is uh, more specific on the asia on on this car so uh, the model car is asia 1.0 g with the type of new so the price of this car is 32,845 and uh, it is the uh, interest fixed interest and the rate of interest is 2.92 percent per annual so our monthly payment is 346.20 cents so we are uh, about planning to uh, to loan a bank uh, for nine years which is 108 months um so uh the bank that we choose to for making a car loan is Effin bank the reason why we choose this bank is uh Effin bank offers the lowest interest rate to get a loan for new cars which uh, is stated on this picture which 2.92 percent per annual for a maximum nine years and for a new car and it also just fixed flats which means that um, the 2.92% it's fixed for the past nine years, not change. And requirement needed pass, we have, which means that um, our our monthly payment, our monthly uh, wages, it's passed for us to loan from this bank, to make a loan from this bank, and also and it also offers debate for early settlement. Which means that if we manage to uh, pay pay the loan early, so we can get discount from it. Uh, for the reference, uh, I get I've got from ringgitplus.com. So this is our amortization schedule for car for car loan. So uh, our period is uh, nine years, but in this amortization schedule, we're choosing uh, by monthly. So it had so nine her nine years have hundred and eight months so the uh monthly payment that we have to pay for the bank is 346 20 cents per month and the interest paid is 79 uh, interest paid is 79.92 per nine ringgit principal repeat is 260.39 and the outstanding loan balance is 32 ringgit 578.71 for the first period uh for the last period for the last period which is 108 the outstanding loan balance is zero which means that um for uh the period of 108 we already settled all the loan from the bank so next so for the next part it would be a uh, home affordability next so here we have to calculate the net money survey which is um 3380.37 minus 12% of the uh, 3380.37. Actually, 12% is um, the 12% 12 of gross money salary will go to EPF, so and tax. So the net money salary it would be 2974.73 ringgit Malaysia. Next. So here we have to uh, determine the maximum GSR limit that service ratio. So uh, here, as we can refer on the table one, that service ratio table, uh, we can see that uh, the net money salary uh, 2974.73 match with uh, those bands and we choose uh, CIMB and BSN. And as stated on the table, the maximum GSI provided is 60%. Next. So here is the list for uh, money commitments. So it consists of PTPTN and also card payment, which is PTPTN, we have money payment 200 ringgit and for card payment, it would be 346.20 ringgit Malaysia. 
So as we calculate, the total would be 546.20 ringgit Malaysia. Next. So here is the maximum home loan eligibility. So we have to use this, uh, this formula, which is max DSR 60% multiplied with the net salary, which is 2974.73. And then we have to minus with the uh, existing commitments, which is 546.20. And then we have to uh, multiply with 200. So here is the value for maximum home loan eligibility, which is 247727.60. The reason we have to find this value is so that uh, we can estimate the value of the price that is relevant for us to buy. Next. Okay, next, which is home. Next. Yes. Okay, for property details, which is our home, we choose uh, terrace setingkat taman rasa sayang Kuala Pilah, which the property details, which is the property type is single story intermediate terrace house, which is the, in the middle house. So next is title type, which is placehold. Uh, which consists of three bedrooms, two bathrooms, and size which is 20 times 70 square feet land. And I need info for this house which is Bumi Lot, and the facility which is near the most, the clinic, convenience store, hospital, and city center. Next. Next for the home description. After some research, we have decided to choose this property because it is a reasonable price and within, within our budget. The location of this house is strategic since the house is near to Masjid Kampung Selaru, Chai Berjaya Inter Enterprise Convenience Store, Hospital Kuala Pilah, Pusat Bandar Kuala Pilah, which is the center city and also located near to the workplace, which only takes about 25 to 30 minutes. The house is a single story story terrace, which consists of three bedrooms and two bathrooms that I said before. And the size of our house is 90 square feet or, uh, or 20 times 70 square feet land. As a precaution and safety of our property and ourselves, we are able to park the car at the car park since our half house has an enough space to park the car. Okay. So for the down payment, uh, we are choosing the bank that we are going to make a loan for our home is a Maybank Commodity Maybank, which is Malaya Banking. So the reason why we choose Maybank is first is practices Sharia compliant home financing. So it's good for our uh, Muslim. So the second is offers low monthly installment with a longer payment period. Um, Third is great, give a great rebates for those who make an early settlement. As I said before, uh, if we, uh, if if we manage to make a uh, early payment, so it will uh, we will get some discount. Uh, and also annual income fix the requirement needed, and uh, we can choose whichever interest rate that suits for our finance. Uh, it means that we can choose for the interest. We can choose for fixed, tired, or variable profit rate. So uh, the reference from this Maybank is from ringgitplus.com. So the down payment for house is uh, we decided to make a ten percent from the from the uh, from the price of house, which is the price house is 140,000 so 10 percent from it is 14,000 and the loan payment that we make that we borrow from bank is 126,000 okay for the payment and interest so next slide so it is about uh, how we determine the monthly payment amount of the mortgage and the total interest of on the loan of our choice uh, for the maximum mortgage tenure uh, that you are illegal for, eligible for. So uh, this is uh, the formula that we need to use. So by using the formula given, uh, so we will know the value of the mortgage monthly payment. So there, there are a few things that we need to list out uh before we 
continue our calculation. So firstly, we must know the loan uh, period, uh, which is uh, in years, is 35 years uh, that we want to pay the home. Um, so nextly, the annual interest rate uh, from my bank, my bank, uh, which is 3% uh, that uh, given in the term uh, in my bank. So uh, nextly, we need to convert the loan period uh, in years to the month. Uh, so the number of payment in months is 420. Uh, nextly, the annual interest, uh, we need to convert it into the monthly interest so we can uh, get the, the interest uh, each month, which is 0 0.0025. And lastly, the loan payment, uh, which is the uh, the remaining value that we need to pay after we pay the deposit, uh, which is 10% uh, from 140,000 uh, for the terrace house. So the remaining is 126,000 ringgit. So nextly, uh, uh, based on this, uh, this value that we list up, so we just need to uh, put inside uh, it into the formula. Uh, so 126,000 uh, times uh, the value uh, is equal to 484 ringgit 91 cent. <laughs> so uh, interest of the loan uh, that we get is uh, which is uh, the total uh, the interest that uh, the bank took uh, from the from our payment lah, so twelve payment a year of four hundred and eighty four point one ninety one cents for thirty five year. Uh, so when we my um twelve times thirty five times four hundred and eighty four ringgit ninety one cents. Uh, so we can get two hundred three thousand six hundred sixty two ringgit twenty cents. Uh, so the so we must uh, minus it with the initial borrow, uh, which is the remaining. Uh, the remaining value. Uh, so the the total interest of the loan uh, after we sub subtract it is seven seventy seven thousand six hundred sixty two ringgit twenty cent. Uh, so next page. So this is the amortization uh, schedule of the home loan. So um this schedule is for us. Uh, so we can look uh for each month how much we pay, uh, how much the interest uh, we paid, the proposal, the principal uh, repaid and the outstanding loan balance. So uh, from period uh, one, first month until the last month, which is 420, 420 months. So we had been uh, settled down our uh, loan, uh, as you can see from the table. So uh, that's all from me. So next slide. Okay, next, which is other financial commitments and incomes. So next, other commitments, which is electric bills, water bills, and Wi-Fi bills, which come from our home. And for other incomes that we have, we, we do, instead of being a lecturer, we invest and do a tutoring and grab car driver. Okay, the next one is reflection. Okay, so first, what did you learn, if anything? Okay, so from this project, we realized that how important it is uh, in our daily life. This is because uh, financial knowledge um, about loan, interest rate, um, annuity, and so on, uh, really help us in making financial decisions. For example, we learn on how to apply a bank loan to buy a house and a car. Uh, we also learned that we have to pick a bank which uh, offers low interest rate and we also have to choose a house and a car that uh, based on our salary so there will be an excessive money to buy other needs like food clothes or uh, and also other commitments like what my friend mentioned earlier um water bills electric bills and so on so uh, secondly do you feel more confident with financial decisions yes since we have learned about uh, basic financial in the class and already applied in this project, we feel more confident in making financial decisions in our daily life. Next, do you feel that it was beneficial? Yes, despite of learning financial mathematics theories, we finally got uh, to put ourselves 
in the position which we have to decide our own financial by applying what we have done in the class. This project taught us on how to manage our future plan from getting a job, uh, a car and a house. Uh, actually, uh, it is, um, it is uh, important to plan early since um, we plan it uh, for the long term period. Last but not least, what would you change about it for the future? Uh, we would start earning set income such as doing some business online or saving some money from now on. This is because we think that it will be helpful in the future since some of us have to pay student loan which might uh, ruin a little bit our future plan uh, after we finish our study. So with the money that we save, we can uh, pay the student's loan or other financial problems because um, there might be unexpected times that we cannot avoid that might become hardest for us uh, in the future. So uh, later we can focus on more, we can focus more on how to achieve our goals. So I think I have come to the end of our presentation. So I hope that we can, we can apply what we have learned in this project in our daily life to achieve our goals. Mm. And that's all uh, for us and thank you. Thank you.